Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For anyone new here, my name is Alana Noel and today is a very exciting video because I am unboxing the new Dyson Era multi styler in the complete long. Guys, I could not tell you how excited I am to record this video. Like honestly, it feels like Christmas day. It arrived this morning by a DPD driver called Gary. Thanks, Gary. And here we are. So I got it in the Persian blue and the rich copper colorway, which I'm actually very excited about because I have a Dyson Coral and it is also in the Persian blue and rich copper colorway. And it's actually my favorite colorway. Blue is my favorite color. I'm actually, I'm dressing all blue today. I'm matching, I'm matching. That wasn't actually intentional. It just kind of happened. I am going to unbox this with you guys. I haven't even looked at it myself yet. We're gonna have a little chat about some of the new attachments, so let's go. I'm a little bit disappointed that they don't have is they don't have the little mat and um, that usually comes on top to set your air app on because I do know that sometimes whenever you have an attachment on and I've been using it for quite a while it can get really hot and then I don't want to like set it on my bed or set it on the dressing table so I'll probably just use my old mat from my previous air app I'm sorry guys, I'm just so excited. I just like keep feeling like bursts of like excitement like go through my body because I'm just so excited. Okay, right, I'm gonna stop saying that. I'm gonna calm down, Alana. It's okay, it's okay. Okay, oh, that is just, that is just so beautiful. It makes me wanna cry. So in terms of like the body, I don't really think much has changed. It has all the same settings. Oh guys, it comes with a round brush attachment. I think this is the bigger round brush. I do know that Dyson also have a little thinner round brush that you can order. So I'm just gonna clip this on. Make sure it all works properly. Yeah. Yeah, gorgeous. For anyone who watches my videos, you know that I absolutely love the round brush attachment. It is currently my favorite attachment, but we do have the flyaway attachment in here and we have the new barrels, so this might actually get pushed to the back a little bit. We're gonna have to wait and see. And we obviously have the brush attachments. We have the soft smoothing brush, firm smoothing brush. I tend to always use the firm one. Again, you may have seen my videos on the smoothing brushes. I absolutely love them. I think that they're an attachment that gets overlooked a lot and they're really, really good. So obviously you get both the smooth and you get the firm one. But these smoothing brushes are slightly different because you may notice, and if you have the previous air app, you can go lock, the brush doesn't move. So it means that you have to hold the brush at a certain angle to get the airflow onto your hair. Whereas with these, they actually move around. If you can see that. So obviously that means you can change the direction of the airflow, which means that it's just gonna do a better job at smoothing and straightening your hair. Next thing I'm gonna talk about, which I feel like a lot of people are very excited about, is of course the new barrels. So let's chat about these. So this time you only get two barrels. So in the previous air app, you got four barrels. So you basically had two barrels for the different thickness um, for each side of your hair. Whereas with these new barrels, what you do is they come with a little nozzle on the top and you can see these little arrows and rather than having to change the barrels for your different side of your hair all you do is you just move the nozzle around and that means that the airflow goes in the opposite direction so you don't have to change the barrels and guys like i just feel like i mean i'm not gonna lie first of all i'm a little bit like why didn't they just do that to begin with <laughs> It seems very simple. Or maybe they did that purposely so that we all had to buy another one, which they probably did. And here we are. 
Sorry, just another burst of excitement just came over me there. Okay, I'm gonna cut it down. Obviously you have one that's the same length, but of course a different barrel size. I use both of these. Um, the thicker barrel is great if you wanna just really quickly add some nice big thick bouncy curls into your hair. The thinner barrels are really good for weaving your hair. It just gives a lot more defined weave than what the thicker barrels do. I have tutorials on both of these using the previous era, but I am going to do updated tutorials on both of these barrels. So that will be coming very soon. But yeah, these are very slick. And I can't wait to use these and I just love this little feature. I feel like a lot of people are gonna be very excited about this because I know that a lot of people used to have to be like, oh my God, I have to change the barrel. But yeah, this just makes it so much more efficient. And guys, last but not least, which I'm sure you are all very excited for is the air wrap attachment the air wrap attachment fly away attachment <laughs> guys i'm not gonna lie like it actually looks it looks quite confusing really um it looks a little bit like a lint roller whenever this first came out about two weeks ago i've seen quite a few people comment saying it doesn't have a hair dryer attachment like you're not going to be able to dry your hair and i remember being like oh, outrage that they don't have a hair dryer attachment but like how are we going to dry our hair? Like, how are we going to use these appliances if we can't dry our hair? Because we need our hair dried by 80% before we actually use some of these appliances. But I feel like people jumped the gun a little bit. So actually a hair dryer, so you can blast your hair and dry it with it. And also does the flyaways. So again, it has this little nozzle at the top that you can rotate depending on whether you are using it to dry your hair or whether you are using it to get rid of your flyaways. Um, so I think here is where the air comes out and then what you do to use it as the flyaway attachment you basically just swirl that around so you make this fan hide behind that so it's just fully smooth all the way around and then that's what you use to get rid of the flyaways so guys honestly like i cannot tell you how excited i am to try this attachment because like my flyaways are something serious i've actually looked back at some of my old youtube videos and there i am with my hair all finished thinking that it looks great and then i have like a gazillion flyaways like crazy at the top of my hair and i'm like honestly like I just look ridiculous. <laughs> I have read and heard and seen a lot of amazing reviews about this. So I can't wait to try it out. Should I try it out now? I, I was gonna do it in a different video, but I feel like I need to try it out now. Maybe I'll just have a little whirl now and then I'll do like a full video where I like properly try it out. Okay, right, yeah, I'm doing it. I feel like I'm convincing myself. <laughs> that was just another burst of excitement there. Like my real personality is coming out in this video, like, I'm clearly like a little bit weird. I definitely can notice that that's a little bit smoother. These flyways are on this side. I don't know whether you can notice that. Like I said, I am gonna do a video where my flyways are crazy and then I'm gonna properly test the out so we can see how well it is because I do have crazy flyways. They're just a little bit tame today, which I don't know why. Usually they're always out of control. But hey ho, that's just typical, isn't it? So guys, if you're watching this video and you are wondering whether or not you should upgrade and get this new Dyson Era, so maybe just hold your horses for a few more days and I will let you know my opinion on that really soon. I'm gonna compare the previous Dyson Era to the new Dyson Era and let you know whether or not it is worth investing in the new one. That way it'll just give me a few days to start using this new Dyson Era and so that I can work out myself whether or not I've wasted like another 500 pounds buying another one or whether it was worth the investment. So that will be coming very soon and of course I will be releasing lots more tutorials on the Dyson app as well as my course that's going to come very soon which you can sign up to my mailing list for free so I can keep you up to date on when that is going to be coming out but like I said guys it is going to be very very soon. So thank you so much for watching and I hope that you enjoyed this quick little unboxing and I will see you next time.